Welcome to the Daily App Show. Today we're going to take a look at Lambo vs. Zombies. This is a very fun game. Addictive and first thing you're going to notice is the attention Let's to dance, detail. Baby. So there's lots of sound effects and uh, kind of things to keep you on your feet in this game. Uh, you're going to notice the great graphics and uh, lots of options. So at the menu here we can view how to play which is a tutorial on how help. to play. It takes us through with some images and some text that shows us uh, the different details and so that will load up and we'll have our help menu here. We can also view our rules and our monster book and then hit the return key to go back. We have superpowers that are also available. This is an unlockable option, which you can see I've unlocked. I have many Lambos unlocked, which means I have too many pistol shooters available to me. That's a 99 cent upgrade. And then I also have Super Lambo turned on. That's a free unlock, as you can see. You could turn him on and off. Down here, you see that many Lambos are deployed. Let's go back. We also have our lame stats. stats, which we can view just to kind of see how we're doing overall in the game. And uh, so you get your stats. This is also Game Center integrated. I'm playing with a preview version, so I'm playing in the sandbox. Uh, but what you're able to do is unlock achievements and different things, which of course allows you to uh, battle against your friends for uh, having the most achievements unlocked and all that good stuff. Tap on options and we have some basic options here, sound effects, music, turn on and off vibration. Uh, you'll notice that in settings, on or off gets larger, whichever one you have set, which I have set to on. When you start the game, there's a story that plays and it's a video and it's a short video you can watch and it gives you kind of a breakdown of why Lambo exists and why he's so uh, you know, ready for battle and what's about to happen. But I'm gonna take you into the game where I can tap play and we go right into uh, the option where we can start a new game or resume an old game. Now, because I have a game going already, I'm gonna choose resume old game. I have went and started games under Zombie Farm. That's the first section that I've started to play in. We also have a store available to us, which allows us to make purchases. Let's go into farm. Zombie Farm, and I'm going to go into uh, the barn. Now, you can see there's these stars underneath each level. There are three different difficulties you could play this game, and for each time that you compete and complete a level, uh, on a different difficulty level, you get additional stars. So let's tap the barn. We're going to go poison. right in. I can choose easy, medium, or hard. I'm going to choose easy get to get him, started. Tiger. That way I can focus on talking about the game while playing it. And just a quick load here, and we're ready to go. Zombies coming! Alright, so we're in the barn. We're in wave one of three, which means we have three waves to complete this game. We have all of our guns down below that we can choose. Uh, some of these are unlockable. You have to make some money, and you make money by killing zombies, and then by tapping on these gold bags that some of them drop behind us. Notice sometimes you can pick up additional ammo and even health. So you'll notice I'm also toggling between having the mini lane bows and not having the mini lane bows and what direction they're pointing. So now they're shooting in different directions. Now I just have our super lane bow, and now I have all of our lane bows, uh, our super and our small one. So you'll see this icon up in the top left-hand corner up here from time to time. That allows you to go into Armageddon mode, and you can rapid fire upon zombies. So if you come to a point where just too many zombies are coming onto the screen, and uh, they're getting too close to you, and you really need to attack fast, simply tap on Armageddon mode just like that, and then you can tap on the screen, slow down, and just fire away. And uh, from what it says, it, when you're in Armageddon mode, you use up less uh, ammo, it's kind of just a special mode that you can uh, go into attack. To switch guns, you can see here I switched to a different style gun, which uses my ammo now, so you want to be careful not to use up all of your ammo. Let's go and just try a couple of these different guns. 
as you can see, all of them with different killing abilities. You want to be as accurate as possible because the points and everything that you receive, you get at the end. Uh, you're, you're receiving, um, you know, stats basically on how many zombies you kill, your accuracy, and all that good stuff. So you want to be careful not to just shoot for the sake of shooting. You want to uh, try and get those chain bonuses to get more. I say points, but what I really mean is more money so that you can make purchases and unlock guns and get more firearm and all that good stuff. So, um, after you've killed a certain amount of zombies, each uh, wave is a different amount for each level. And uh, now we can move on. It's going to take us to the store where we can upgrade. Let's check out your score. All right, so not very good on the accuracy. Weapon upgrade. All right, so now is where we can do our upgrade. And you'll see how much uh, funds you have available over here on the left-hand side. Now, um, if you don't have enough funds, then you can't really do anything, but you can unlock and upgrade additional firearms. So let me go over here to the right-hand side, dance, and baby. you can see here on this one, I've already reached the maximum level here on upgrading, but I can bam, buy more bam. ammo. Burn, baby, burn! Bam! Some of these guns that I was shooting Boom. with are low on ammo now, so I need to go and recharge them, buy some more ammo to get back up to that full mark so that I'm ready to go for the next stage. Now, uh, what you want to do, of course, is complete as many of those levels as you can, get throughout the game, unlock more achievements. The levels are going to get more and more difficult. And then as you get better, you're going to want to go ahead and increase your difficulty so that that way it's more challenging and uh, you're getting more cash and all that good stuff so that you can unlock more weapons. Um, so that's what's available in the weapon store. So this game, I, I really like it because the graphics are great. It's fun. It's addicting. Um, it's not too difficult. It's a game you could just pick up and start playing uh, at any time and then put down when you're ready. Uh, you can always come back and restart your game and start again at the beginning of one of those levels. Uh, so it's very cool. I think you're going to like Lambos versus Zombies. I'll go back to war now and I'll start playing on the second of that third wave and continue on towards beating that uh, entire zombies level. Coming. So definitely check out Lambo vs. Zombies. I think you're going to like this game. You can get it in the App Store.